going on, YouTubers? YouTube-based enjoyers of pipe tobacco and cigars and other frying tobacco products. That's what you are. Anyway. It's Derek Tant here. Welcome to my back porch on this, wind, on this windy Wednesday Valentine's Day afternoon. Just waiting on my bride to get home. Having a pipe, enjoying some, uh, enjoy, enjoying a tobacco. I'll tell you the tobacco in a minute. Uh, my Hector Weeb radiator with the uh, Morgan Bones bowl, taking color quite nicely. So, yeah, it's a good day. So, the subject of this video, I made a local trade. And I made a little order. Um, let's talk about the trade first. My neighbor Nathan, who is, who lives like a mile that way. Um, Nathan probably smokes more pipe tobacco than I do. And he's a younger, cooler, better beard, more handsome, you know. He's the YouTube pipe. Guy, he's the pipe guy that you guys deserve, not not me. He's he'd be cool. He'd be great for YouTube, and he watches a lot of y'all as well. Anyway, I I contacted him the other day because I'm trying out new blends, and I was like, hey man, you got any Bijou, you know, from Cornell and Deal? As I know, he loves that blend, and I said, do you have any open Bijou that I could like take a bowl from? I was gonna you know offer him something in return, you know, just like a quick little trade. He was like, yeah, man. He's like, I'll be right over. And so he shows up with like four bags of tobacco. I was like, dude, you didn't have to do that. But that's how that's how pipe smokers are. So he got some stuff from me, but I'll show you what he got me. I put them all in jars, but he gave me some Cornell and Deals Bijou, which, by the way, really good. It's Virginia with Turkish. Very fragrant. Real good stuff. All right. Another Cornell and Dillon blend. Bluegrass. I know Eddie Gray loves this stuff. Dark. It's Virginia. It's dark-fired Kentucky. I think there's Perique. Maybe there's Perique. I don't know. I hear it's similar to Doubloon Oro. So, going to give that a try. Let's see. Drucker and Sons. Inn of Court. It's one of those, it's that shop that Greg Pease used to work at. You know, it smells like a little bit of lot of key in there. Nice little ribbon. Looking forward to that. And Esoterica Tilbury. Never had it, never have. Um, but there you are. You can see it. Look at that. Gave me enough to fill up a jar. So I was like, thanks, man. So he got some 40th anniversary, some father dinner. I gave him a bunch of stuff, you know. We, it was an even trade. <laughs> but thank you, Nathan. But I also went on to tobaccopipes.com. Made an order. Just in case, you know. I don't know if they're going to be making any more 40th anniversary. But the last batch I got was from 2017. This was the 2018 drop. I got a little bit of that. And on the recommendation of uh, Justin Taylor, got a couple of tins of Dunhill's Durbar. I'll be cracking into that soon. And what I'm smoking in the radiator is Sutliff's Red Virginia Ribbon. What? Alas, are you worried about the uh, the lack of McClellan's 5100 Red Cake? A nice Red Virginia Ribbon. But look at that. It's nice and sweet. No ketchup smell. And the taste is mild. It's a little sweet. It is just a nice 
red Virginia ribbon, like it says. It doesn't bite, it packs well, it behaves well. That's good. And it's cheap. You can get like a pound of this for 20 something bucks. I ordered like this this little pouch, ounce, you know, it's an ounce and a half. Yeah, ounce and a half. Three bucks on tobaccopipes.com. Three bucks and some change. Three bucks. And it's, it's nice. It's lovely. So guys, don't worry about McClelland. There's tons of great tobacco out there. You just got to find it. You're going to love it. So thank you for watching. That's my soapbox. That's my display. I appreciate you. Smell my beard.